Hello guys, it's your girl Nana, and this is the Nana Nation. So if you're new here, a very special welcome to you. Please go ahead and subscribe as we dive into today's topic. So today we're going to be talking about Cameroon's International Film Festival, Kamif, which just occurred in Boya. And we have these beautiful designs to comment about. It was a beautiful ceremony. Stay tuned as we break this down. So this was Kamif's cultural night and all the actors and actresses were required to appear in traditional regalia. So that's why you see all the people on the red carpet dressed with these beautiful traditional designs from all over Cameroon, from the southwest region, from the northwest region. So first up, we have Miss Stephanie Toom. She's an actress and Stephanie is styling the hell out of her togo. This is a togo design from the northwest region of Cameroon. She made it into a beautiful glamorous gown with a strapless top. Look at all the details, the beads and the gold chains on the chest and a beautiful fishtail ending with ruffles towards the end. She accessorized properly. You can see her beautiful fascination you can see her matching her red lipstick to her red beads and the red bangles and she has a traditional accessory on her shoulder this accessory is highly respected in the northwest region and in the grass field regions of Cameroon so Stephanie is rocking a beautiful design from Shasha New and it's well put together top to bottom the design the styling and the way she is slaying it kudos to you mama you did your thing and this isn't the first time that Stephanie is styling the hell out of a togo design so you guys remember just last year or two years ago when we had the red carpet for saving bango stephanie also stepped out in a beautiful togo design which was strapless as well with a fish tail ending again so this is the second time she's styling the togo in a glamorous way and it works so well for her and now we're going to move on to the next design next up is teacher baby teacher baby is a Cameroonian actress who rose to fame after she played a role in the movie The Fisherman's Diary. So her real name is Ndamo Damaris and a baby girl came to stay, a baby girl came to slay. You can see by the twinkle in her eyes that she was born for this. She loves the spotlight. She loves all of that good stuff. So Ndamo Damaris on the red carpet is slaying this gorgeous princess gown. It's a beautiful ballroom gown, big and flowy and elegant. And it's amazing the things we can do using our normal traditional uh, material. So this is Ndamo Damaris. She's been winning a couple of awards after The Fisherman's Diary and you can tell Tell that she's going to be around for a very long time she's ready for this so that's our beloved teacher baby slain in this gorgeous gown by kibon and fee and now we are going to move on to the next design coming up next is the beautiful cameroonian makeup artist called ojong chelsea ojong chelsea i'm in love with the color of your design like it's so fresh it's so vibrant it's so lively it makes so much sense so chelsea is rocking this beautiful cold shoulder design you could call it an off shoulder you could call it a cold shoulder the same stuff and it's also a fishtail gown and she's working her little beautiful blue purse it looks beautiful everything comes together lively and i particularly love her arm candy you know us girls we like to have a little something something on the side you know arm candy is making the whole design come together perfectly they fit together like a puzzle so that's a nigerian actor and i love that the blue from his dress complements the blue from her dress they look so gorgeous together if they were a couple then that would be a picture perfect couple so now we are moving on to the next design and then we had the gorgeous Onyama Laura. Onyama Laura is just her royal eminence. She slays on every red carpet. So her design is fresh. It's so lively. Like the colors are giving me life. She was walking around looking like a bowl of roses and instant identity on the red carpet. When you look at this red carpet, the first design that catches your eye is Onyama Laura. The colors are vibrant. They're lively. I love her dress. A little off shoulder here. It's almost like it's a one-sided shoulder. You know, the same fishtail team. Everybody was going for a fishtail dress. Um, it was just one of those glamorous events where you have to wear a long gown and most of the ladies went for a fishtail i love how fresh and lively her design is with her beautiful serve and her smile is always her biggest accessory kudos to you laura i love how you rock on every single red carpet next up is the delectable caro and hamasa <laughs> mamasa mamasa don't try talk for mamasa so <laughs> So that's Karo Mbeng Lilian and Hamasa Kopis. His real name is Lovet Lambert. And they are gracing the red carpet in beautiful designs. They look like sour people. So, you know, the traditional white shirt and the loin cloth. That's what the Bakure people or the sour people would wear. And then Karo has her kaba, typical of the African woman, typical of the Cameroonian woman. So they're doing great. I'm just happy to see Mamasa. Mamasa. <laughs> on the red carpet their comedy is taking them places and i'm just so happy for them when you mention comedy in cameroon right now caro and kopis they definitely have to be on your list if not the first or second or the third at most they're really doing well <laughs> oh pancho just appeared on this red carpet like as a more <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, Pancho does appear like a native doctor. Dum dum yum yum. O karamo, o karamo. O karamo, o karamadu. <laughs> he came out here with a red dress, and the red is just so opulent, like it's repelling almost. So, um, O Pancho, CY in turn, Mr. 8020 <laughs> for the culture. So, O Pancho is out here looking funny with his red design, but you know, he's a grand fair, and that's what he does. O Pancho doesn't have time for anybody. You guys can say what you want. I mean, he's always going to do what he wants. So, O Pancho is pictured here with, um, um, Ndukong Joel. Ndukong Joel is also one of the contestants from Biggie 237. He was on the first edition of Big Brother Cameroon. And these are just, I can call them village elders. <laughs> Everybody with their own togo. That's Senior Pastor, the comedian. And CY Inter and all these other people. They came out with their own traditional designs, you know, rocking the red carpet as best they could. So that's what we have to say about that. So we equally had African movie legend Ramsey Noir, Mr. Tokumbo. So Ramsey comes back to Cameroon every year for Camille. He has such an amazing relationship with the Cameroonian movie industry. So every year when it's time for Camille, he always comes to Cameroon. He always assists. So that's Mr. Ramsinoa on the red carpet, rocking his beautiful Togo design. So this is a prep a party, a net a party, ready to wear Togo design. It's just a shirt, you know, and he accessorized with a beautiful Togo traditional cap too. And then he also just wore a normal pants and his normal vans. And he's looking good. It's put together real quick, nice and fresh. So that's Ramsey on the red carpet, wearing his Cameroonian design. I mean, he was just transformed into a Cameroonian uncle, a Cameroonian bay. So we need to give him a Cameroonian name. I don't know whether I'll be calling him Mr. Ngua or whatever. But you guys should find a nice nickname for Mr. Ramsey. Tell me in the comment section below. So we equally had makeup artist Ornel Labelle. She's working a beautiful design for Maretta West. And you know, the problem with these cute little dresses with a robe over them is that the whole evening you have to be posing. When you wear a normal dress, any angle you stand, your dress will be beautiful. But when you wear a dress, like this you have to be working your body you have to be working it your poses have to be very strategic in such a way that your dress the beauty of your dress and everything has to come out so it's a dress itself that requires a little bit of working you have to work it the entire evening and mama is doing just fine mama is working her dress i mean she's doing everything she can to make sure that she gets those angles and those beautiful poses you know for the gram so um that's what's going on right now we have Camille. The Cameroonia International Movie Festival currently going on in Boya, the Mountain Hotel. So they've been on for like four days now. And tomorrow, Friday, is going to be the final day. That's when I think they're going to hand over awards to the people. It's going to be an interesting thing. And people are going to be dressed once more for the red carpet. I'm definitely going to come back and give you guys more details. It's going to be hot. So the entire week was Kamif's week. And we had Ramsey Noir, a producer, actor, director from Nigeria. He's been doing master classes, teaching the people. They've been having very interactive sessions. If you are somebody who is interested in movies and, and you know, you want to do movie making and all that stuff, these are the right seminars for you. They've been having seminars in UB and Fee 250 and Fee 750, but I saw just few Cameroonians attended the seminar. Every day you'll be asking me in my comment section, oh, Nana, I want to be an actress. Oh, Nana, I want to be an actress. These are the opportunities you should be cashing in on. These are the opportunities you should be making the most of. So you have to go there and learn. When you want to become an actor, you follow actors. When actors have seminars, you go there and learn. That's the way you amp up yourself. That's the way you get many um, advice from professionals who've been there. You have to work with people who've walked the path. You have to work with people who've chosen the path before you. So you want to make sure you hang out around these people. You learn from them. You follow them on their socials. You learn from their seminars and the things they do every day. You can learn so much about the profession just by observing. And that when you finally get there and you're about to implement, you've learned so much from all these good people, from all these great names that were there before you. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I am your girl Lonana. If it is your first time on this channel, please subscribe, like, comment, tell me what you think about the video. Tell me what types of videos you'd like to see me make in the future. And uh, share the video with your friends and family so we can get this topic going. So we can get that community talking about Kamif, which is the Cameroonia International Film Festival. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, stay safe everybody. Wear your face mask and all that stuff. Protect yourself and your family. Subscribe, like, share. I'll see you guys in my next video. Goodbye.